Pat, we just spoke for the attorney, for the woman who is making these accusations. It's very disturbing. What attorney Lisa Bloom says is this female detective was in a relationship with an officer at the LAPD and that he was abusive and that he also took explicit pictures of her and that distributed them after the relationship was over. Here's who we're talking about. This is Isabel Villegas. She's the alleged victim and Danny Reedy. Isabel Villegas is a robbery homicide detective with the LAPD and Danny Reedy is an officer in Central division. For what we know right now, according to the attorney for Isabel Villegas, is that she was in this relation starting, relationship starting in 2013 and that it ended just about a month ago. And then when it ended, that's when she says Danny Reedy sent out pictures that he had no permission taking of her and he sent them to at least a half dozen other people inside the LAPD. And we're told by the attorney that Villegas found out because another female employee at the LAPD told her about it. It was a humiliating and shocking act, according to Lisa Bloom. She alleges that it was a very abusive relationship, that he physically assaulted her on a number of occasions, hitting her in the head, for example, that he took explicit photos of her without her consent, and that he threatened to expose her, post those photos on social media and send them out to other people if she left the relationship. And Bloom says that's exactly what happened. Now, also in this story is that Viegas was married and is married to an assistant chief, Jorge Viegas. Now, this was an extramarital affair that she was having with the man that we were telling you about, Danny Reedy. So this gets a little confusing. Jorge Viegas also retired early because of an extramarital affair. So this all sort of playing out. Apparently, they have reconciled this relationship. But now, Lisa Bloom is asking for a criminal investigation. She says that's happening. She's also launching a civil lawsuit. Lots more to get to. We'll have it on CBS 2 News at 11. Reporting live in Woodland Hills, I'm Tom Waite. Pat, back to you. Thank you.